Hello everyone. How's things? Okay, we've got um, a brief comparison video tonight. I'm going to compare three compressor pedals. Um, they're sort of similar, but they, they kind of do different things. And I just want to see if you can actually tell the difference between them, just to see what they actually do. Um, start off with, I think we'll just go with the, um, basically the, the industry standard, the, the MXR Dynacomp. Um, this is like one of the more modern ones. I mean, if you wanted to be particularly fastidious about this, you could get one of the old ones um, on eBay or, or wherever. But, but yeah, just a, a Dynacomp comp compressor. You get these from most places. So we'll, we'll start with this one. Um, now we're using a Boss Katana today. That's that's going to be the amp that we're using. Amp of choice. Um, so we start. Yeah. That's the amp on clean. Neck pickup. And then the Dynacomp on. That's the Dynacomp, um, I mean I got this particular, you know, mainly, I was going through like a um, sort of Andy Summers type phase and I realised that Dave Gilmore used one of these as well, but then like I say, I think a lot of people have used this one in, in the time, so but particularly Andy Summers and, um, and Dave Gilmore, so if you're after that sound, um, it's worth checking this one out. Okay. Next we'll go, this is probably the poshest one I've got. Um, this is a, a Keeley compressor. Now the way the, um, the, the way the, the controls are set out here, they are a bit more um, sophisticated. Here we've got sustain, blend, level, tone, and you've also got a little switch here for single coils or humbuckers as well. Um, but this is, a, this is a setting which at the moment I sort of uh, I quite like this one, so uh, so we go with that. Uh, let's see, right, and uh, just need to give it some uh, some power as well. Right. Okay, so we're back on to uh, yeah, back onto clean without the effects on. Put the compressor on. See, that's a stain feature. I really like that because it, because it helps the notes bloom a little bit more. We can perhaps boost the level a, li a little bit, just not much, but yeah, just yeah. Um, For leads, yeah, and so on. Okay, so that's the Keeley, and then because um, I was just gonna let like, this next pedal, I was just gonna just demo that, and then I thought, well, actually, it might just be worth just doing a comparison, um, just to see, you know, whether it's worth uh, having more than one compressor. Uh, so the next one is this. I don't think they make this anymore. It's a Marshall. You've probably seen or heard of this, the um, called Edward the Compressor. 
it's obviously put on it, Edward the Confessor, but yeah, Ed, um, Edward the Compressor. Uh, we've got so we've got emphasis, volume, attack, and compression. So in some ways it's quite similar to the the Keeley, but um, but it's just like with I mean like the even though the names are different, the actual function is is very, very similar to to um, to on the Keeley. So. So I think we'll go with we'll we'll, we'll try that one next. So uh, right. some power in and uh, right. Okay, it's a bit quite weighty pedal that one actually. I mean, uh, okay. So so clean again. Now I like this one because I like that attack feature that you can use it more for that those sort of like Nile Rogers sort of um, you know those funkier sort of things. <laughs> Copyright strike for doing that, am I? some leads as well just Was your favourite of those? I'm actually liking the Marshall one myself. Um, but uh, just let me know what you think. I just thought I'd just do this brief comparison. Um, yeah. Alright, please let me know. Alright, thanks for watching. See you next time.